booktubers, it's the Huffle Puffle here, and today I'm going to be telling you where the hell I've been since February when I posted my Winter Kill book talk, which is the last video that I posted. Well, I haven't been doing much of anything, to be completely honest. No, no reading. Like, I've read, what, one book since Winter Kill? Three books technically, but two of them were graphic novels that I read. Okay, no, wait, I've read four books since Winter Kill. Two of them were novels, two of them were graphic novels, and, um, yeah. <laughs> Five books this year is really not a great, great thing to be at in the middle of the year. So I'm going to pick it up, the pace, hopefully, before the end of the year. I'm going to be doing the booktube a probably, if I remember, and then that'll hopefully get me on a roll reading again. But really, it's, it was Winter Kill's fault when I played Winter Kill, because I, it was just so amazing that every book I've read since then, I was like, it's not going to be as good as Winter Kill, so why am I even bothering? And that is, that is the problem. I read Miss Mayhem, which was amazing, because I love Rebel Bell, and then I thought, Okay, so that was amazing, and it was after Winter Kill, so surely other books, but then it became a problem, because I was like, well, it's not going to be as good as Winter Kill or Miss Mayhem, so what's the point of reading it? But then I read The 100 on the plane ride to New York when I went to New York. Yes, I went to New York, that is um, besides the point. It was not for any reading endeavors or fandom endeavors, it was for dance, so you probably don't care. And then I read Sm um, not Smile, Sisters and Drama by Raina Talgamar, who's the my favorite graphic novelist because I read Smile by her a while back and like a really long time ago, and it was absolutely my favorite graphic novel that I've ever read, even though I haven't read that many. And um, then I discovered that she had written two other books, so I bought them and read them literally in an hour and it was awesome. Um, so that's that's really all I've been doing reading wise. Currently I am reading two books because I'm reading a graphic novel and a regular book. The first book I'm reading is really really exciting and this is hopefully going to get me back into reading again except it might have the same problem as Winter Kill because it's Dark Tha by Kate Borman so this is the sequel to Winter Kill. Yes this book does not come out until October but because I'm like besties with Kate she sent me the arc and, um, yeah, you're jealous. You're jealous. You're jealous. Um, and I'm also reading the Infernal Devices Clockwork Angel graphic novel because I love Clockwork Angel and I like graphic novels, so I thought, why not read the combination of them both? Um, I also, um, plan, I plan on reading the Lux series after I finish Dark Thought, which will be soon because I haven't had a lot of time to read lately because I've been at VidCon! It was the best experience of my life. I'm going to be putting up a little VidCon vlog, hopefully, if I get around to editing it anytime soon. And that is really, really exciting because VidCon was, it was amazing. I met all my favorite booktubers. I met Christine. I met Kat. Okay, not all of them, but all the ones that were there. <laughs> Christine, Kat, Jesse, uh, Dylan, um, Natasha, Raylene, Reagan. So many booktubers, and I also made some new booktube friends, which are A Thousand Book Street and A Book-ish Fairy Tale, so you can check them out, because I'm going to be putting their links in the down bar below. I'm sure you know who all the other booktubers are, though. Um, and then, there's the whole thing where I met Dan and Phil, and Ingrid Nelson, and Brizzy Voices, and Jack, and Dean, and Benjamin Cook, and... Bertie Gilbert and Tim H and uh, lots of people. I met a lot of people and it was awesome and so I'll be putting the vlog up sometime this week hopefully and I don't know what I'm doing with my hands so just ignore that. Um, yeah, so I'm reading Dark Thought. I'm going to finish it today hopefully because I'm going to sit down and I'm going to read it because I've just been having the spurts of reading like a chapter here and there and it's kind of annoying and I hate reading that way. I have to kind of sit down and read it. So when I get a spare chance I will sit down and read it today and that's going to be fun. But I'm also going to be filming and editing a lot today to catch up because, you know, I am a terrible booktuber and haven't posted since February. But hey, it's not like I'm super popular or anything, so it's not a huge deal. 
if I was, I would be making more of an effort, but because I'm like, ah, the 39 subscribers don't care if I post for today, and then that turns into a week, and then a month, and then several months. And, yeah, I'm so sorry! Um, anything else that I need to talk about? I don't think so. That is it. So, Hufflepuffle out.